As some of you probably know, uh, the fan has a worm gear on the back that turns things. And this is it here. And uh, so when it rotates, uh, the two gears mesh and it turns slowly. And I was thinking of using something like this to, because this is nicely, nice and light. Uh, I was going to put a water wheel instead of the fan and my air lift pump turning it and uh, instead of this and to get the the right speed here to transmit the the, um, the force here to get uh, four kilos of turning power back here because four kilos of turning power will turn my um, reflector and um, I can probably do uh, do it uh, with less than four kilos, but uh, this would mean I could replace um, the barrel and the half barrel and all this with this and a little airlift pump underneath it. So this and a little pool of water underneath it and a couple of tubes can replace that stuff there. So, um, yeah, I think I'm going to try that. But um, maybe the 3D printing guys will look at this from wider afield and it would make a very nice kinetic sculpture if um, you had a little, a little um, water wheel, a 3D printed water wheel running various things and having you know kinetic sculptures and that sort of thing um i was um the um fan that i use in my experiments um has all this is made of metal and i've looked i've searched for another metal one and i i have only found plastic ones and this one here which has a plastic gear I think yeah it's got a metal piece but plastic gears so I have not found I guess uh, they've converted all this to um, plastic pieces uh, and uh, the one I found in a thrift st st shop was probably 20 or 30 years old from my previous experiment so that's a little disappointing because I don't think plastic gears are going to be um, tough enough to, uh, for the four and five and more kilo um, force on them. Oh, and the other thing is, um, the great thing about this is it's called the worm gear, and it only transmits uh, from here to there. So it's... Um, I guess it's kind of like a diode almost, uh, a mechanical version of a diode, which is always a little bit exciting. So uh, it uh, won't, won't go, uh, the power won't go back, it'll only go forward, and it'll go forward in both directions, but this cannot make this turn. So that's kind of a cool thing. There's another thing I'm looking at, there's a, um, there's a guy who's talking about um, uh, ca ca forgotten what it's called, camstock gearing, and I might try that on my experiment. But um, yeah, uh, these things uh, may not be suitable for. I was really hoping I could just use this directly somehow in my project. So you'd have your water wheel maybe turning quite quickly and um, this turning, this or this turning really slowly and moving this thing. But um, yeah, I don't think it's gonna work because plastic. Anyway, thank you very much.